All right, everybody. Hello, hello. Welcome to another Rockstar Games live stream. It's official. It's a special one. It's another crew versus crew battle. We haven't done one of these in a while, but this is a big one today. We've got the Malicious Intent main crew versus the Old School Punishers crew, also known as Hero. Um, these guys raced each other a little while back, and they're doing it again. We've got two very special guests. Repping Maine, we've got Bob Mendez, who we have here today. Hey, Bob. What's up, people? How's it going? <laughs> What's up? My team's going to whoop that ass today. All right, I like the confidence. And then Repping Hero, we've got uh, Beck. What's up, Beck? Hey, man. <laughs> How you doing, man? I'm good. Now, I'm, uh, still Be looking forward to this. Beck is all the way over in the Netherlands, right? Yes, I am. Yes, now, I am. Uh, Bob beat you because he he lost. He had some internet issues and uh, know what that's about. But uh, he actually went. He was in his van before talking to us. <laughs> then he went to his buddy's house. He's done everything he can to be with us today. He cannot play, unfortunately, but he is repping the crew. Thanks, Bob. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it. And wish I could be there playing, but I'm here at least supporting the crew, man, doing what I can do. Um, this first one is uh, it's called Curve Circuit, and it was created by uh, Playman VT, which is um, Beck's buddy. And he is not here today, but he is the acting leader of that crew. Uh, we played this one yesterday. It was a lot of fun. That today, man. Stay malicious. All my boys. <laughs> By the way, I love the name of your crew, Malicious Intent. That's just brilliant. That's a cool um, name. And the main tag. I can't, I can't claim that I made the name, but whoever came up with it, man, and and the and the logo, it's just everyone loves it. Well, it looks like what's going on here is a connection issue. Oh, we're good. I don't know. I just lost camera with the. Jay over here, all good. I got my buddy turning his Xbox. I might be able to log in here. Ah, oh, damn it! Of course, man, that first turn, right? Just because there's no contact doesn't mean you can't hit walls. <laughs> right. All <laughs> right. And oncoming traffic. I'm glad there's no traffic. Yeah, it seems to be none. No, there's no traffic on that. Oh, no! It, it, that's a tough race right oh, yeah. there, I gotta say. It's a real tough race. It's really more about not falling to really be successful. Man. But with these guys racing, you gotta not only not fall, you gotta be flawless and fast. Yeah, definitely. Execution's important. Surprised if Hashstone was in the lead right now. Um, the force. Is he just like yeah, the? Is he Ash like the best racer the you guys got? Good stuff. He's he's really a, he's a tough racer, man. I I consider myself a pretty good racer, but a lot of these guys really put me in my place. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, these are some really tight curves here. This is awesome, though. So, I mean, these guys who are at the back, <laughs> like, how do you, uh, how do you rank your crew and stuff, right? What? Who's, if 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 Hesh is the best, who's the? I guess who's? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize you were talking to me. What's it? <laughs> who's who, if, who's who did you say who's was the, not best? the best? Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's a tough question. I don't know, man. I think everyone, anyone could win any given uh, any given uh, race, I guess. But uh, everyone seems to put their money on Hash nine times wow. out of ten. Way to be diplomatic about it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know the best is the best. You can't deny it. Numbers don't lie. By the way, Hash yeah. has a job that he created that we'll be playing later on. So looking Rock forward to that. Circuit, one. yes. It's that's the uh, best races, uh, custom-made races I've ever done, man. It's a challenge and race the cross sur circuit as well. That's what so we started doing with the GTA 5000. It started off somewhat simple to keep the races kind of short and simple, but. As we kept getting better and better races, and we ourselves were getting better, we needed to start stepping it up and make some harder tracks. So you're starting to see a couple of the more challenging tracks when it comes to this, at least from our crew. No, I can't so speak. Cool. Uh, yeah, okay. Go ahead. Oh, 
I was going to say, I can't speak for the other crew, but uh, at least our races, I know, are pretty challenging. Oh, yeah, we <laughs> ours are pretty challenging, too. I think yeah. our, our races are a bit more lengthy. Yes, for sure. Uh, oh! But still, that? man, they're Barry. all very tactical. You have to be on your toes, each and every one of these races. All right, well, so far, it looks like Malicious Intent is... Uh, you know, they're they're not accepting that grief, but uh, we got plenty of time. <laughs> they will, they will. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, oh, baby. Man. I wish these guys could hear me, man. I'd be fucking going crowd. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I didn't say anything bad, right? No, you're good. I think this speaks to the caliber of racers, man. Uh, we are way back here. Uh, yeah, it's pretty sad. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, the only person I'm really racing right now is Play Rockstar, and he's cool. completely doing me in. Maybe they're just that good. No, that's exactly no, what that's it exactly is. Yeah. Good. No, yeah. So you're not that, you're not yeah. bad. It's just they're super good. Oh, yeah. no, I'm, I'm fantastic, but you're right. These guys are just on another, another level. level. Well, yes. I mean, the amount of racing they're doing, yeah. you got to figure. It's really ridiculous. I mean, I mean I, literally, I, I was speaking to them before we started, and they were like, yeah, man. I, one dude was like, yeah, I haven't, I haven't looked at an, a TV other than to play GTA for the past two or three days in preparation for this. That nice. was like, that was me. <laughs> yeah, that's a little. That's whoa. That's a lot of dedication right there. I mean, right now our guys are just coming off the first season of GTA 5000. I mean, you're talking about oh. every week practicing the races like nonstop. You see the playlist popping up constantly on your phone. Just the playlist GTA 5000, GTA 5000. These guys are practicing nonstop. So every one of those circuits is just tooth and claw all the way. I imagine. Oh, uh, yeah. It, it, it was quite a battle all the way to the end, too. I got to say, uh, the Stronzo team kind of took off with it, but second and third place was a really awesome battle, and uh, it just made the whole event, basically, having that. And Playman kept score, like live scoring on the last round of the event, so it was just, it was amazing. Ah, Stronzo <laughs> team, that's pretty cool. So they went with in-game branding on that. Oh, they, yeah, they went everything. Like, uh, everything's everything from the game. All yeah, That's really cool. All brand names. Schlongberg Sack Team right here. Nice. <laughs> oh, nice. Represent. I'm actually trying to get logged into my buddy's Xbox right now. So let's see what happens there. Maybe I could actually get in on the next race. I don't know if it. I don't know yeah. if I get all your shit at when you just yeah. log in from someone else's house. You, um, I mean, if do you have your profile already saved to that kit? No, I'm, I'm putting it in right now. Email yeah, address and all that shit. I mean, hopefully you got all your saves saved on the cloud, right? So you'll be able to just bring that down. No, I don't. Well, actually, that's... well, your multiplayer <laughs> stuff should be good. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. The multiplayer shit should be there. I'm just uh, if your okay. friend hadn't completed the single player tutorial, you know what I mean? Okay. So yeah. I just had a painful moment just now. Hash just lapped me. I'm in <laughs> last. Well, I'm <laughs> in fifth surprised. place. You're in fifth place. Yeah, or the, the, I'm in just to the end here. And Hash, I just saw him just zip by. In fifth place. You're in eleventh place. Yeah. Eleventh <laughs> <laughs> place. And I have <laughs> Hash and Leona going by me like no problem. You say hi to the world, bro. <laughs> Everyone say what's up to Ryan, the good guy that let me Rockstar. come to his house and uh, make this all possible. Not a problem, not a problem, thank you. <laughs> they don't like you. <laughs> oh, the Xbox just said hi to me. Damn, I should have brought the beer over. I was going to be sitting outside of this guy's house. Looks like I'm commentating on the race that I can't see. I know these guys are probably in the zone right now, but uh, I'm here I'm with you. I'm in the zone, man. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be your oh, distraction. I'm zone guy. I hope our guys can get it done. hope I can join this. Yeah, it's messed up. Ashton will finish it first. Leo finished it Yeah, first. baby. Leo's another great racer, man. Don't don't uh watch out for Leo, man. He's a he's a real skilled racer. All right, Salmon in third. Le Leo's that great, but you're only now just talking about him. I mean, like ten minutes ago, it was all about Hash. <laughs> I'm just yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah. Hash deserves a little credit, man. He's really he's he's done his thing, man. I can't. I gotta say. 
But uh, Leo, man, he's he he came up like out of nowhere too, because he tell he'll tell you yourself that uh, he wasn't really that great of a racer, and then the GTA 5000, man, put him into another level. He just he's he was winning like crazy. Fair enough. Fair enough. But like I said before, all these guys are great racers, man. Even though they're, I gotta, I gotta give it to the other crew too, man. They got a handful of great racers, and I know they're missing a couple guys. I know they won't tell you that, but uh. <laughs> <laughs> um. Man. So all right, so oh. you guys have been playing all these races that we're gonna play today, right? Oh yeah. Really well, nice. Tell me, tell me which is like the most high octane, like crazy race we're gonna be seeing soon. Like high octane, like speed. And hold on a second. Hold on wait, a second. wait, hold on. I just want to say, I, absolutely, you can see it on the screen, but we have to congr congratulate our buddy Hashstone. Oh man, he was amazing. There you go, Hash baby. Way to be Hash, malicious. Leonia. Okay. Three, four, five. Top six. two spots. Um, I'm, I'm ecstatic, man. Hashstone got the big win. We said Leo came in second, man. I'm real happy about that. I gotta say, I'm not surprised though. So when you do these tournaments now, are they the same rules every time? Um, no, they vary. Uh, if you're talking about the GTA 5000, mm -hmm. uh, or you're talking about the, like the crew battle we had recently. Uh, no, let's talk about the tournament. You know, what are, what are the general rules? Uh, the general rules, we we try to we've been trying to run more stuff in non-contact because there's just always some type of issue with guys or someone's bumping into each other, whether it's you know it's an accident or not. It's still. It, it really takes a toll on the racer if like there's an accidental bump and sometimes you get those little glitches you know and your car will jump side to side and the non-contact just resolves all that for me personally but a lot of guys still enjoy contact races because you get that aspect of racing where you're trying to pass each other and you get that better feeling so there's really I don't really know what the I can't really I don't really have a good answer for what the rules would be really because at first it was all there was non-contact was introduced right as the tournament was starting so it really threw a curveball at us, like, what should we do? Because we already had a set of rules ready to go. So then we started incorporating the non-contact a little bit. And for me personally, I really started enjoying it. You really got to see who the best racers are. So Dude, I'm doing this for a reason, bro. I called Comcast to make sure I had connection issues early on today so I could just fuck with your head the whole time. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> and your TV looks really nice. Do you ever feel like it's lagging or it, it plays everything that's pretty smooth? Yeah? Smooth, man. Very smooth. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I was talking, talking to my buddy on the couch here about his TV. Couch guy. The couch guy. The guy on the couch. Right. Oh. That's hey, some solid guy. <laughs> the guy. The <laughs> guy. There was some traffic just, yeah, there's some traffic. <laughs> yeah, it's there. Woo. But watch out for it this time around. What race are they playing right now? Fuck. We are on, this is Redwood Ridge, right? Yeah, Redwood Ridge. Oh, uh, yeah, that's a, that's oh, a long race. Bet. This is your race. race. Yeah, man, I created this can you, uh Can you tell us a little bit about it while you go, or do you need to focus? Uh, well, I can tell you a bit about it. Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, um, I created this uh, race um, along with a couple of others in, uh, into one big playlist. I like to make playlists uh, rather than only uh, uh, a one race, kind of. So this is all based on a uh, an old racing game, which I don't know if I can uh, call the name here. <laughs> but uh, he was in first before, and Beck, you're uh, it's your race. You're in third. That's pretty respectable. Uh, yeah, man, I hit some cars, man. Fucking traffic. It happens. <laughs> I <hate> that. <laughs> oh, no, Let it out. Let no it excuses. Out. <laughs> no excuses. I mean, there's a pretty good excuse for playing against malicious intent. I mean, that's a good excuse, you ask me. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> when you get, I knew the nice guy act would fall away exactly. eventually. Exactly. <laughs> hey, malicious for life, man. It comes out all the time. So the race is over? It's official? We're in the second lap. We just hit the second lap. I think this... Uh, so there's still time. There's still time. I might have spoke too soon. So, all right. So what is, what's your what's your strategy if you're in second or third or fourth in a long race like this? 
and the person what do you what do you what do, how do you catch up to first or second place if you're in third a race your own race okay and yeah and man. just enjoy it for what it is at that Stay point consistent yeah. try not to crash and hope someone up, up ahead kind of takes it a little easier just maybe makes a mistake and all you could do is not not make any mistakes yourself and hope yeah. to catch up it always comes down to the next guy's mistake when you want to get ahead once there's a yeah. clearance you there. especially on you can only do so good yeah so i mean so the length of the race kind of matters right you know the longer the longer it is the more likely someone's gonna make an error essentially right yeah. not exactly not exactly I would disagree because we have we run multiple races that are super short lap races and there's there's a lot of opportunity to crash in some of those. I mean, it just it could happen anywhere, you know. Fair enough. You could really, you could still get a good a good lead on somebody in a short lap race too. Like last race, you got lapped or whoever got lapped. Yeah, yeah. I <laughs> man, I definitely got lapped by the entire run, so it was pretty bad. I mean, that wasn't uh, that's really wasn't a small race, but I mean, Playman itself, he's got another race like Bell Gecko or some, which I think is an awesome race. It's probably as short as a race you could be, and it's with super class, and it's around the dock area, and there's a lot of left to right, left to right, and it's just. It's an awesome race, but you can get lapped twice, you know? <laughs> sure, just with maneuvering around. All right, not not asking you guys to give too much of your secrets, right? But, so this is the thing here. Like, when I'm racing with my coworkers, one of the one of the big kind of things that we always argue about is when you're going around a tight turn, right? How to approach it. You know, there are those of us who like to slow down before the turn, and then there are those of us who like to actually, like, power slide around the turn. What do you guys tend to do, and how do you approach those kind of tight turns? That's a good Depends question. The turn, in my opinion. <laughs> what happened? So do you power slide turn. into it, or you just let off the gas? I'm kind of a let off the gas kind of guy. Depends on the car. It depends on the turn. Like, you know, it's very hard to tell. If you got a hairpin uh, turn with the Gentarno, it's sometimes really good to slide it through. Right. Yeah. Do you uh, find that you get a little bit of a boost coming out of that slide, like when you come right back, like when you lock back in coming out of the slide, do you feel like that gives you a little speed? Yeah, sometimes, yeah. yeah. So many turns vary in so many ways when the amount of speed you're coming in with, like he said before, the, the type of car you have really makes all the difference in the world, but the amount of speed and type of turn really comes into play, because a hairpin turn, I'll use the e-brake, but uh, on a nice little 45 degree type turn, I mean, I could possibly barely let off the gas and then step right back on it and be almost full speed through the turn. So right. I think it varies it's all, all about the time. The, Just, and the speed that you're hitting it at, right? It's all about experience, I think. The more you race, the more you start feeling it, you know? It's more of a feeling, I think, more than an actual, like, on paper. Getting a little like, time with it, my friend. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> oh, hash just got passed? You guys should, should watch up front, man. It's very uh, tight ending there. Hash and Marcus are fighting it out. Beck, I have a question for you. Uh, let's say maybe not all of us are wonderful race creators, such as yourself. Well, what, what does it take to make a great <laughs> race? Um, yeah, dude. Spending a lot of time in Creator, I think. Oh, by the way, I have to interrupt. Our boy KD Marcus 420 just won. Yo, we got some finishers right in. behind. Hash right behind him. Sorry, go ahead. Who, who was right behind that? Hash. Who, who was right behind Hash? I didn't see. Uh, Beck. Beck looks like Beck came in oh. on third. Yeah. <laughs> he knew it. With, With all the yapping too. <laughs> <laughs> You're good, my friend. Hey, Let's ben, watch the rest of this race, uh, and you can tell us uh, later on your creative genius. <laughs> That's okay, man. Well, actually, now that I make a talk about it a little, I think. Oh, Ash, baby. <laughs> I know Ash going to probably uh, crush this one, man. Left. It's his race. It's his race. Can you speak on it a little bit, Bob? I can speak on it. It is a, I'd say it's a very difficult race. Uh, Probably a good eight out of ten on the difficulty rating. Uh, now, why do you say that? Turns and I say that because you gotta. It's a race that you gotta learn a little bit. Like if you don't, if you it's your first time playing it, you're probably gonna have a tough time. I guarantee you're gonna hit a set of palm trees. Uh, 
you got to really find the right path to take. And uh, once you figure master that, you can really have a good time on this track and put together a good lap time. Yeah, you know, I got to tell you, at the beginning of each one of these races, I feel like I'm just throwing money at you guys by putting 2500 down. You know, I don't ever find it rewarding to put $2,500 down. I find, I, I'm always betting $100. Dollars are always better. I don't right. Know. That's, the move. <laughs> That's the move right there, huh? <laughs> One hundred dollars down. That's it. That's all you need for some satisfaction nice on this wager. Some more gambling activities, though, in the game. Absolutely. Hey, uh, Beck. Yes. Hey, so I mean, I, I've been meaning to ask Bob already, and I've been meaning to ask you. Um, Not gonna be able to. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry that I'm talking to you during the race. I don't want you to end up in third again. <laughs> but I'm gonna ask to anyway. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Um, so, I mean, I, I like races that, you know, are, are like in crazy locations and stuff. Have you created any races that, you know, are like in some insane locations in terms of like, you know, maybe the subway or uh, jumping off hills and stuff? I like, uh, I did a sort of, uh, a re sort of remake, you could say, of uh, your, uh, of the Rockstar race, uh, Down the Drain. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, only I made it in that little uh, southern southern drain that's mm -hmm. a little smaller and I uh, locked it to compacts. Right. What's so it called? It has some jumps. It's uh, a bit crazy. What is it called, man? I'm, I'm not even sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> down the drain. Looks like Cash is holding down first right now. Yeah, but Salmon's right behind it. Repping Hero. But Let's then again, it is it is Hash's race, so he he's the expert. He knows what to expect. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, almost all these races oh. have been a race that he's owned everyone in, right? KD DeMarcus well, 420 no, went into second. second. Yeah. Yeah, watch out. For oh, Marcus. into first. Yeah, for DeMarcus. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and say this is the the closest one so far. Yeah, I would almost put money on that Hash would come in the top three almost every race. I'd say. Nice. You know what I'd put money on? I would put money to see you guys, Hero and Main, in a contact race and see if you guys devolve or not. Like, are you still going to drive these nice clean lines or do you guys get dirty? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no GTA. We don't even need the guns. Just contact. I just, yeah, with contact on, I'd love to see how your, how your driving changes, if any, at all. I mean, you got to be more cautious than other drivers for sure. You got to, it's tough because people take turns so many different ways. I mean, and then when they might just hit the brake just a little bit ahead of you and that just force you to slam into them sometimes. It's right. really about reading the racer in front of you at that point and really trying to make your pass. Sam right order takes him for a second. He was a little bit that? behind, but he caught up. But it looks like Hash still has a very healthy lead, so we'll nice. we'll have to see if he can gain on him a little bit. Gotta say, a few of these turns are really deceptive. You think it's gonna be like a nice, easy little left or right, exactly. and all of a sudden you're at a nine, like a 90 degree angle. I'm sure you've met those four palm trees right in the middle of the road <laughs> I was talking about. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did a little earlier. Stay to the left of those, my advice on that. We're watching our, our leader and creator, Mr. Hash. Love saying that name. <laughs> really knows what he's doing. <laughs> Hashtag Hash. Can we give a shout out to Play Rockstar for actually not being the last person on yeah, this race? For a change. We should there applaud. We that. should. I, I mean, or should we? <laughs> <laughs> should we? <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. Clap at that. this point, yeah. dude. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is maybe the first, yeah. the first one. I, I have to respect your ceiling. Yeah, and man. The, <laughs> you got to get them where you can. Yeah. It's like in like, being John Malkovich with that, like the eighth goals. and a half floor. Exactly. <laughs> ceiling there. I just made a ceiling. No one can see it. Yeah, no, it's not visual. You've got a face for radio, though, so it's okay. Oh, oh. 1940s joke. Yeah. <laughs> yep, I'm sure you guys could just, like, put in some code or something and totally win every race if you really wanted to. Yeah, yes, we I could. That that every once in a while. And just oh, look at Beck. It. Guys, we're doing all this yapping, and Beck is right on the heels of Mr. Marcus. Oh, wow. he just <laughs> took him. He just <laughs> took him. He just overtook him. Beck's trying to focus here. Unbelievable. Should I try to get back did in the really head? Did you really say Mr. Marcus? I, <laughs> what? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> no, we're not going <laughs> to... No, 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 man. Don't Everyone in this room just got red. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got... <laughs> 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 he's, he's taking penicillin for that right now. You would think they were a little too young for that, but, you know, it's okay. 
this might get weird. Two dragons. I think it already got weird. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe if I mooned him, that would possibly distract him. It more. is. It is the coolest thing to see Beck and Demarcus's name just switching back and forth as they vie for second place. Right. <laughs> Three palm trees. I mean, it's cool for me. For you, Beck, it must be absolutely nerve-wracking. <laughs> no, 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 absolutely not, man. I know, I know Demarcus. <laughs> I know he's going to finish in front of me, regardless. I don't know. He's <laughs> right there. Taste it. Yeah, right, but still, there are a couple of laps to go. Yes. Yeah, anything I mean, I, I got I to admit, like, that last turn that you guys took, he definitely had a lot more acceleration coming out of the turn than you did, which is, I'm like, the, these are the questions that, that's why I asked that question about the turn before, because it's hard to know how to take turns sometimes. Yeah, it's really just practicing the race, I think. That's the only way to yeah, really... Yeah, so you, like, you like know oh. what to Oh, oh there, there it goes, there it goes! You did it, Mr. Not Beck, like you did that. it. <laughs> Mr. Beck... <laughs> Mr. Everyone gets a Mr. Yeah, well, we're very proper here. Yeah. It's a lot of respect. A lot of respect. <laughs> Whatever happened to that guy? I love this music. I don't know. Well, no, he just came out. Oh, wait. Oh, never. We're not even going to go down this rabbit hole. <laughs> yeah. Let's take a look at Hash. So, Hash, tell us, what's going on here? You're, this is the first time you've been less than third place. What's going on? Whoa. What? Oh, I'm sorry. That wrong person. Completely wrong person. Yeah. We're watching Griffin. <laughs> yeah, we're watching Hearthstone 89. Now, he oh. still has a healthy lead, but, you know, we got to take a look at the champion, you know? Oh, God. I got to have been looking at so right now. Right now. Palm trees. And I guess Leo and King Solo, are they having issues? Are they not in right now? Uh, no. I don't think yeah. so. I didn't, I didn't really pay attention to. Uh, there was, were a lot of guys getting out and getting in. I think you still have your people, but we'll see yeah, how these go. Now it looks like they need to restart on the playlist, maybe with the remaining ra races to get them back oh. in because they're having issues trying to join back in with you guys. And Mr. Marcus back up at second. I, I'm just gonna go with it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Beck, I'm gonna say this again. That last turn that you just took before that train car turn, that's the same turn he catches you on every time. Yeah, man, that's, whoa, what the hell? What happened? What just happened? I don't what happened? Know. You get disconnected or something? Oh, I'm just standing here. Yeah, guys, we had a bit of an issue, so just hang in there. Yeah. We will. I need a beer. <laughs> Could you get me one while you're at it? I thought I was going to be sitting in this guy's parking lot and bring the damn beer. <laughs> he was home when I got here. I was like, ah! <laughs> At least I didn't get to sit in the air conditioner. By the inside. way, for, for all the people who have no idea what's going on with you, Bob, you sound like a serious gaming home intruder right now. Seriously? Yeah, you know, I broke into my buddy's house using his <laughs> Wi-Fi. And, uh, and drinking his beer. I'm not home anytime soon. These right. guys, I don't even know if he has beer. Let me, let me, I'll get right back. Let me check the fridge. <laughs> what is the name of your website? If you do that, I'm going to have our friend here in chat. He's going to drop uh, drop a link. So I everyone can check it out. It is maliciousintent, with two Ts, dot webly, dot com. I'm going to show it to you on screen on my phone, as a matter of fact. Maybe you can get a little view of it. Oh, I don't we'll know. see. We'll see if that works. <laughs> Mm, boom. That actually ah, looks, looks pretty, pretty good. Clear. Yeah. And then that's our photo back there. If you can see, there's a naked woman with the main logo. That's a, uh, you know, just how we roll. We've got bitches and shit. Wow. Uh, well, that's very tasteful. <laughs> We're rolling forward with it. Naked <laughs> sports. Everyone's been practicing with muscles. So that'd oh, be interesting. Oh man. <laughs> Hey, little are curveball you, by Rockstar. Are you are you trying yeah. to say that we set this up specifically to give me a better chance? Is that? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't. I, I, hey, you said it, not me. <laughs> we had to hedge our bets here. Yeah. I'm still putting twenty five hundred dollars out instead of a hundred. What? We're betting? I do. Someone loan me a hundred bucks to throw on Hashstone, please. Yeah. Right. I, exactly. I literally just throw it out the window as we start. Yeah. This was made by Zed Grande. Yeah, Zeitgeist. He's a crew member of ours. Mm -hmm. It's one of the few races he made, but uh, it's a very, very tight race. Long uh, squeezes. 
guy everything. Still now, Beck, have you played this one a lot? Or? With the muscle cars, it's a very hard track to, uh, to master. So that's why we wanted to race it on muscles. Beck, uh, Beck was telling me he actually played all the races. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Before today's yeah. event. Practice, baby. <laughs> Our crew's been practicing all week. Forget about it. I'm pretty sure their crew has, too. Yeah, yeah right. what, what muscle car are you using there in that race? Dominator. Dominator's a good one. Dominator. I was having a tough choice there. I couldn't figure out what to use. The Runer or the... I don't even know what the... I can't even think of the other one right now. The yeah. Gauntlet. It's always tough to choose because, like, Dominator is, you know, the first one that comes up when you choose from that class. And you and you kind of just feel like, well, maybe something else is better, but it really is one of the best. Irish man off I've, to an early lead from Hero, but oh, the 57th from Maine just took it. He's also another good racer. Got to give him a little shout out there. He's uh, definitely always up there with everybody. And your boy Leonia uh, is back and in second, followed there we by go. We need Leo in there. We need Leo in there, man. You said he's, he's a, a solid racer. racer, right? Yeah. Big time, big time. Very consistent. Please, nobody, nobody switch to me. This is just, this is deplorable. Oh, we won't. Embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping it warm in the back. <laughs> Very warm. Oh. A little stretch going here. There are some serious curves, turns right? Yeah, yes. exactly. Like it's insane. He said it. Yeah, it's tough. There's a lot of slowing down there and. Tough, uh, tough with the muscle cars. You yeah. gotta really get that drift sometimes. Not that even one, wanting uh, it. That one as you're coming up on the pond is, is just really brutal. Yeah, I know exactly. We were talking about like in the little neighborhood there. Yeah, I ran right into some posts coming right up on that thing. I'm running into a lot of things as we talk right now. This is pretty <laughs> just... I should say we've got a main rep in the top three right now. Leonia, the 57th, and Hash. Oh, there we go. Oh, interchanging, oh, but they're back rep for three. Nice. Irish had an early lead, is now in six. We need this, we need this malicious. Let's go. I have all you guys finish oh, top three. Still tight, lead. still plenty of game. <laughs> no traffic on the street. Suddenly an E. Cola truck. It was kind of Yeah, weird. what's up with that, Ryan? What's up with that? <laughs> I, we get that in races quite not, not while, often, right? but well, one I mean, out of It's, it's so parked many. traffic, so maybe it's yeah. a different kind of thing. I know, but sometimes there's been a couple races in particular that it like just almost ruins it because a car randomly popping up. Yeah. Next gen, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I always like to think there's an X factor. There's always little random fun things that can happen when we're playing this. You game. can look at it that way. Yeah. Yes. All right. That's that's the silver lining I like to take with it. There you go. The, the, Guess it works. It's you called emergent, about... emergent <laughs> gameplay. Now, there's always going to be issues with games. I mean, what, do you, what the hell are you going to do? Everything can't be perfect. People need to expect that. Uh, I think our crew is more understandable about that. I mean, you get tired of some things, but hey, man, this is a remarkable game, bottom line. there's, there, you, We all know you push the system to the max, so it is what it is, man. If it was really shitty, no one would be playing it, you know? That's right. We, <clears> we have... Uh, Leone and Hash still in first and second, respectively, but we do have KD Marcus for 20. Didn't say the other name. Of course. And third, course. and he's right on their heels. So, really, you know, one wrong turn, it's a different ball game. We also have yeah. Timeless Salmon, a name I also like saying <laughs> behind him. Timeless Salmon. I gotta say, Leone was like the game changer, man. He really came in and gave Hash a, a run Yo, for his Absolutely. So, I, what was uh, what was the logic behind the cars that you guys ended up picking for this race, considering that you know the the class was changed on you last minute? Ooh, hash takes first. Uh, um, I went for safety and took my Masakro. <laughs> right, right, right. And why do why the Masakro? I think I'm more confident in the Masakro than in the Allergy, so mm -hmm. that's the only reason. You just know it better. Is it is it weird yeah. that I like the 9F Cabrillo? I really I just think it's balanced. It's not. The fastest by far. I just like the team. Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, I guess you're the fastest, probably. <laughs> I would yeah. love almost, almost. I would love to know what car Hash, Leonia, and uh, Demarcus chose, and why they chose those. That would be kind of cool to know. I 
pretty sure Hayash has an elegy, and Leo's got an elegy as well. That they might switch sometimes. I feel like that's what I mostly see them use. I should know Hashstone's on my racing team, but uh, lucky me. But uh, he's uh, I always see him in the elegy. I think a green elegy, maybe. Right. I have to give that elegy another spin. Yeah, I know, dude. Like, I never, I never liked it, and now I'm hearing all you guys say that you like I, the elegy. I've been I'm looking like, into uh -oh. the elegy lately, and it's, it's really, really a preference popular. thing. Yeah, yeah. I just, I always it, felt it was too slidey for me. That's the thing. You know what I mean? The trick with the elegy, I think, is like, I, I said it to someone one day. They're like, "Wow, it's really good," but now I can't even think. It's something like, you don't want to use the e brakes too much. You got to like do a lot of like back and forth with the brake and letting go of the gas a little bit. Like tap the gas, tap the brake, okay. go back. I see. What really. You're and sometimes it's it's hard to explain because you're just doing it so quick on the controller, but then it's like a lot of back and forth, it seems like, on the right. left uh, so joystick, it's too. So it's definitely more of a finesse vehicle. Oh, guys, right. we're missing a one and two here. We're, get, we're changing off one and two between K. DeMarcus. Wow. And Hash. Oh, that's a shame I can't see this right now. Don't get too in the zone, Beck. You need to screw up, man. <laughs> I already did. I already did. <laughs> I'm here with my buddy Irish. <laughs> That's an awesome race, man. Like these yeah, little really good. from Kerr Park and shit. Oh. So uh, I'm, I'm forgiving. I just hit a bad. <laughs> Man, I bet it works really well with sports cars. I gotta say, I'm learning a lot just watching you guys take turns again. You know what I mean? Like, I just. I wouldn't take turns like this normally. Just clean. You can barely turn. You can, like, right there, I can tell that DeMarcus slowed down a little bit to take that turn. Yeah, sometimes it's just easily just letting go of the gas for a second and making your turn and then stepping right back on the gas. Right. Yeah, that's the way I like to do my turns as well. It's totally... The brake, uh, you know, it's easy to slide into things or overpower it. But I know it's necessary sometimes, too. He oh, also, yeah, for sure. Yes, Marcus. Marcus, go on, man. DeMarcus also cuts the corners a lot. He ends up yeah, on the grass, yeah. on the sidewalk. And he's, he's always staying on the outside of the checkpoint, you know what I mean? He's not going straight down the middle, which, you know, that's obvious for a lot of people, but... Uh, yeah, yeah, a lot just, of good racers will know how far they they have with that checkpoint, and they'll, right. they'll really get the apex of that turn as much as they can to save those little milliseconds, you Ooh, know? Ooh, he just got done in that's by a little bit of collision. the difference between the good racers and the not-so-good racers. They really, they could avoid those rock star props, as we call them, and... Uh, Really, just you know, cheat the turn sometimes in a way if you if you want to say and that. And hash wins. Nice. There you hash go, hash. Hash, 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 hash. Man, hash. just took it right back. Leon was right there, right <laughs> on his heels. I, I got a thick skin, uh, literally. We love you, Dad. It's all, it's all. Uh, better you and not me. <laughs> Well, Hash is in first, Sainted Gryphon, another hey, Griffin, oh, Griffin. Griffin, I'm sorry. By Griffin. Though. You can call him Gryphon. I think you guys are cool like that. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, I, clearly. I mean, you're calling Marcus Mr. Yeah, Marcus. Yeah, so, I mean, that's a motto. Gryphon sounds. I know I've got nothing for this, so I'll just go with Gryphon. Just go for it. Marcus isn't the real miss. Time we going out tonight. Where'd you go? <laughs> I don't know what time are we going? <laughs> I yeah, exactly. I can, I can use a few drinks after this one. Oh, yeah. Right near the beach. Yeah. <laughs> Boy. Hashstone again with the commanding lead. It's, there you go, Hash. Yeah. Hopefully the rest of the team can keep up. I'm going to go ahead and say that Hash really, he's been, uh, he's been the player of the game so far, right? He's solid. And he's up there. Yeah, I know. Yeah. If we were giving out MVPs, that's where it would go. We, we should. We, why, yeah, I think so. We just did. Okay, done. That's a hell of a 180 <laughs> turnaround hairpin when you come right back onto the highway under the tunnel, man. That north, on the north highway. Yeah. Crazy. I mean, I imagine if this was contact, you'd just have a pile up there every time. 
that's a tough one, that hairpin turn going into that highway with the contact. That that's when it really you gotta be real careful. We we when it first came out it was not it was only contact. It was tough. <laughs> right, right. Just a pile of twisted metal there. Hey, hey Beck. Yeah. So I know you said before that you've been practicing all these races. You are currently in fifth. You fifth. were in sixth. What's going on? What's so tough about this race for you right now? Ah uh, man, this is this thing is going. This is this race has gotten on my nerves. <laughs> <laughs> well, Bob, you should take that honesty. personally. <laughs> I, I love it. I love it. I, half my tracks are designed to really piss people off, especially some of my dirt bike races. <laughs> right. So, so what's going on, no. Beck? What? How's it getting you? How is it getting? I don't know, man. It's also that Santorno that's so slippery. Right. Sure. Uh, it's still so much faster uh, on the track than than the entity. So I I picked this one. See, so, so what's uh, yeah, it's, it's a hard track, man. It's like. Full speed. <laughs> hey, so, Beck. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Just have to say, Beck, your uh, your buddy sainted Griffin. 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 I can't do it. <laughs> he, he, clearly, this man is I, not I, a geek. I've it's got, a mythical I mean, beast. I've got a block. You haven't it's a played enough beast. RPG. Regardless, That's what it is. I'm going to give you some dice. We're going to roll. We're going to make this happen. I, right. I, I barely knew what that meant. <laughs> Regardless, he is in second, but the pack's behind him, and he's gaining on Main's hash. So this is really exciting. This could be a, this could be big. Really, Main's uh -huh. hash? Yeah. <laughs> Just all right, go hash for it. Hash Main, Main's hash. <laughs> yeah. Just Hashtag with hash. I'm just speaking at this point. I don't even know what I said. <laughs> Hash is good. Let's so, go hash. Great. So I, I would say the, the creative approach on your races is to lure people into a false sense of uh, security on straightaways and then just like drop a wall in their face. Is that <laughs> Would that be right? That, that seems like... What yeah, I, I like the straight there. It gets you a lot of speed. That's why where the slipstream would have came in handy a little bit to have those little battles there. But it'd be nice to get the slipstream off on the turns a little bit. But uh, it was just meant to be a really tight and difficult track really sure and i Same think that's that. what it's proven to be right now absolutely absolutely man hey beck so you were saying before beck before you were saying you feel like you might have picked the wrong car you might have needed to go with infinity oh, no 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 i didn't pick the wrong car yeah I just, i'm just having a hard time controlling the uh Santorno. okay is it is it the turns that are making it difficult what is it the obstacles like play rockstar was saying what is it exactly um well, yeah, it, I mean, it might be the props, but I do think it's mostly the difficulty of this track is going from the really fast speed pace to yeah. going you into that uh, to stop, uh, for sure. hard part in yeah. those little, little narrow streets. Right. And then you go into a very hard, <laughs> fast part again, and then you get that chicane. Right, right. Yeah. It's, it's hard, man. It's very hard. Hey, Beck, just so you know, we are watching you. That's yeah, kind of creepy. That's cool. <laughs> At this point in the race, I'm just happy that I haven't seen Hash drive by me. <laughs> that's true. I'm in the fifth lap. I'm expecting him any second now. <laughs> but you're still in front of King One. Yeah, me and him have a little thing going on. But I Irish is, is right. Is that Irish? No, I'm sorry. 57 is right on back. Back way to go and grabbing fifth. I will, go, I, I will mention about, about this track that uh, that uh, the cabin usage like was strictly. I had to use all those because unfortunately with the 50 prop uh, limit, oh, yeah. I really I was really trying to force players to one side of the road, and I would have loved to make it a lot more sexier, I guess you could say, but right. uh, couldn't couldn't really do that with 50 props, so I worked with what I had. I would say this. Track, I, um, I would say this. There's a nice learning curve on this. By the time you get to the fifth lap, you're kind of like anticipating a little better. Exactly. For sure. Exactly. Definitely need to know that one a little bit. Good job by Hash again, man. Unstoppable. Nice Hash. He's unstoppable today. <laughs> He's a dominant racer. Right. And we're just wrapping up with the last two players. Play Rockstar and King. Ah. Ah, they didn't finish. Yeah, but I, I was the second to not finish. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I want to give a shout out to something. Underdog here, man. He fucked with that fourth place. Underdog.
Nubo, N- <laughs> Nelato, N- N- NL880. Is that, yeah, Shit. Underdog NL80, that's what it is. 10%. Good job. We have a score for you here. All right. I'm Hero better. is up still, but it's close. Hero is up 92 to 86. Bob, get the troops wow. going. You guys wow. can do this. Let's Anyone's go, game. guys. Love you. Yeah. Come up big, get some big finishes on this one. This is going to be tough. It's on their race, too. Can they, can they even their... Bob, can they hear you? Uh, I don't, probably not. Yeah. I mean, maybe they got this guy going, right? Right. Yeah. 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 They, they know I'm with them. That's all that matters. All right. Don't yeah. break the fourth wall. Bob, I'm sorry. <laughs> Fifth wall, whatever. I don't know. Oh, whatever. There's a wall. There's a wall that you don't. Oh, and I started all the way at the back on my own race. <laughs> all right, let's take a look. Good luck, guys. Uh, That's I the best position. I'm on the Marcus here, by the way. No, I can't. I'm going to get me an allergy. I'm back in my 9F Cabrera. <laughs> Should turn it in. <laughs> the guys on uh, on in-game just noticed that there are helicopters flying around. There are. <laughs> we got the yeah, helicam right. up there from time to time. You'll see that little shadow on oh, the Oh, man, I just saw somebody really take that turn badly. Whoa, yeah, there was a little... Whoa. Was that you? Was that you, Rockstar? Did you completely just miss that turn? No, no, I'm still in it here. But uh, there was a little weird fish telling action going on as it came around that way. Um... Might possibly, my computer might die shortly, but um, yeah, I might run and go get my charger real quick while you guys are doing this race. I don't know. Where's your charger? Ten, right down the street. Oh. <laughs> you, Bob, you just stick we'll it out. Wait. We'll yeah. wait for you. How about this? I got left, <laughs> but uh, I, I apologize if I do get disconnected, but what? I'll definitely uh, well, I'll hold on. your Skype. What percentage, to... what percentage are you at? Seven percent. Okay. Ten minutes. It's That's it's right. risky, but listen. In case you we disconnect, why don't you just kind of you know give a shout out again to your crew and what you have going on, and that way if we miss you at least we at least you got it out there, there right? Yeah. All right? That's cool, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. Um, I'll just go ahead and say that uh, you know we know the name Malicious Intent. Uh, I put the website out there, Malicious Intent with two T's. Dot Webly. Dot com. And, uh, I mean, we do weekly events. It's, uh, we've been doing weekly events for months now, and it's, it's always with creators' creations. So feel free to submit your stuff and uh, try, to, try to get in on some of our events, man. We have a great time. We're at the point now, like I said earlier, we're having daily events now at every day at noon uh, Pacific, Pacific, ugh, Pacific time. Uh, we have a daily event where everyone just all they do is simply put their name in and whoever's first on the list hosts their job first and then it goes on from there and in, in order and it's a good way to we share. just we're all about yeah. we're just all about having a good time with each other and trying new things and uh trying new creations and learn from each other and i just uh i really think this crew is something special i'm proud to be part of it i gotta say and uh, i'm happy to be here today along with hero crew here uh they're Thank definitely, you. they got a good group of guys there, too, and uh, Let's look forward to having some more events with them yeah. in the yeah. future, too. Yeah, yeah. Th- thanks, man. You guys are doing really great stuff what, today, and just with everything you're doing with your crew, it's fantastic. Hey, I just want to, I just want to news, news flash real quick. Um, DeMarcus and Timeless Salmon are really taking it to Hashstone right now. Like, they are really trying to make sure he doesn't get this last race in first. This, That's work. Yeah, They're this working. race, and I gotta say, this is very drifty. Like the whole, like so many turns. Yeah. Demarcus is gonna win this race. Oh, is regardless. this? Is that because this is his type of race? This is his race. Okay. <laughs> now Hash is in second. Hash is in second, but have you seen Demar? I mean, like Demarcus has got it. Has, has has gotten a nice lead on him, but Timeless Salmon from time to time will just come up right behind him and just take that second place lead from him. Timeless. Timeless. It is a timeless salmon. Absolutely. Ooh. The Marcus just lost control for a little bit. That's going to give uh, gonna cost Hashstone, yeah, that's going to give Hashstone a little chance to catch up. That's what he was waiting for, that one mistake. And he he's, about he's, he's, uh, he's, he's uh, closing the gap, clearly, yeah. at this point. Can't even, no quarter given, man. 
I am surprised by how much on like on a race like this that he's allowing his car go into the sand because you know it, like it the dirt rather because that can kind of really throw off how you control the car sure. hitting the dirt on a road on a on a race like this with all these tight turns. I think with the drifting is the you know the thing is to go with it, not to fight it. Like when you fight it or you try to oversteer, you always end up spinning out. Yeah. Looks like Demarcus opened up that that uh, yeah. that lead again. He's got there like he a nice, is. I, I see him. Yeah, but it's like a nice one checkpoint lead. Yeah, it is. There needs to be a mistake. I oh wow! And Timeless Salmon has completely uh, fallen to like sixth he place. Fifth. Fifth, so I missed fifth. the checkpoint. He missed the checkpoint. Yeah. On that oh, oh. Yeah, so it's a tough one. And it's easy to do. And you see it again, right? This is this is why Hero is has got that lead on them in the playlist is because they're they're commanding first, third, fourth, fifth. You know what I mean? It's and this is what they've been doing every race so far today. Yeah, that's what that's how we roll, man. It's the teamwork, I think. No, that's awesome, man. I mean, is that a strategy that you guys came into this thing into this I event know, with? Bro. As I told before, we just we just happen to have a lot of guys who are very good at racing, and we also uh, we put in a lot of time practicing these races too. Have so, you have you ever raced um, against Hashstone before? Yes, yes, yes. We did uh, last uh, last time out. So you you came into this race knowing how strong he was. Absolutely, man. Yeah, I was. I knew he was top notch. <laughs> yeah, I have a feeling his reputation well, precedes him. I also him. know, you know, <laughs> Peter Marcus. Uh, he's he's our, one of our best racers. Right. And um, you know, as as Bob mentioned before, we're missing two of our top guys. Like, right. Right. But well, we're still still very consistent, and I'm very proud of our guys right now. <laughs> how different would it be? Who who are these two guys that you're missing? A and B. How much? How different? Would this have turned out race per race or overall had those guys been here? Um, if those guys would have been here, yeah, I think um, they they would have given Hash a real run for his money. And I'd say we have a few who have given him a run for his money for sure. Did you see Hash just take that turn? Like he cut straight across the turn. He didn't even bother like following the curve. Dude just hopped over it. Absolutely. Like that's something like I wouldn't. I would have tried to that's take that turn. Take, that's how you take that turn. No, I, I guess so. But it's just interesting that you know, like, because to me, I would, especially in the elegy, I would have been afraid of spinning out there. So, um, when you guys are doing these practice races, do you just sort of like compare notes? Like, hey, watch out! Up here is a left turn. You're gonna want to let off the gas. Exactly. Like, do you like verbal like? Yeah, man, uh, talking, talking racing lines, I mean, uh, everything, kind of. So that does come up in, like, conversation. You kind of, like, have, like, a lot of different uh, terminology and things that you use to let people know, like, what Absolutely. kind of turn it is. You're all talking nice. about which car, which car is best to use for a track. Uh, you know, um, all, all kinds of stuff, you know, uh, what line is best to drive uh, so you can get a better exit on a certain point of the race, you know. Uh, Everything that will shave off half a second, we'll, uh, we'll talk about it, kind of. Nice. That's totally something that I would have loved to, that for us to have put in the game. You know how sometimes certain games, especially racing games, will have... I mean, I mean obviously, you know, this is, this is an open world game with a lot... You know, it, it has shooting in it, it has RPG elements, it has racing. That's it's a racing big game. game. Play, man. <laughs> but you know how some racing games will have, like, after you do a race or while you're doing a race, you'll see someone else's line. So that, and you know, and it'll kind of help you figure out what the optimal line is. I really wish we would have had something like that in this game. Yeah, or maybe, um, maybe like uh, checkpoints that, uh, like, uh, give you your time. You know, just that you give your time. Uh, that, you, that you get your. Um, Time, like, yeah. How do you, how do you say that, man? <laughs> you split time. How fast you're going across the checkpoint? Yeah, like, like, like on three points of the race, you have like a little timer that pops up. Like, yeah, yeah. Uh, you're going this fast now, and uh, you should be going this fast. Like, right. There's something like that when you push down on the D-pad. If you're in a race, um, it will tell you how fast you're, how well you're doing on a lap, as opposed to previous laps, kind of sort of. Well, we definitely have an inbox for that, for any ideas or suggestions you have uh, for improvements Ooh, on racing or anything else. Beck, that was a hard turn. I'm still getting the third place. <laughs> <laughs>
Second place. Even. What? Mar Marcus you won. You just edged out over Hash, though. Yeah. Nice. Yes. Marcus <laughs> back Hash. What the hell happened to Hash? Wow. Yeah. He he hit that same turn that you did. Bit just yeah. out there. Slightly worse. We have our top three, four, the seventh, the fifth. Got a few guys left, including our very own Play Rock star. All right. It's okay. I told you who would win, right? I told you who would win. You called it. You know, it's, it's just been an absolute pleasure to go through these races today, though. I gotta say, they're all really well uh, balanced and put together. There's a lot of thought. You can just see that and, like, how the, the markers were set up. Absolutely. Thanks, man. Yeah, I put a lot of work in it. And yeah. I, those guys of Maine did too, and uh, I know guys did too. Irish man. Uh, our guy uh, who, um, who put in our third race, of course. Ooh, this is. So we've got, uh, wow, okay, two out of the top three are repping, repping Hero. Absolutely. Okay, DeMarcus, you, Beck. Beck, nice job on that one. Repping big That's time, cool. followed by Hash. And Griffin. Right? Did I have that? Yeah, Griffin, you had it, oh, man. Oh, wow. It, it only took six or seven tries. Whatever. I want some applause on that no. one. No. You, you make a Thank try. You. Right. Thank you. Give that man an applause. You understand yes, what an ethical beast is now. <laughs> would he know it if he ever saw it, though? That's the problem. I think well, he maybe would. Not. A maybe lion not. mixed with an eagle. No. Yeah, I, I know that. Mm, literally shut down about 30 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, we just want to, we're going to get back to, uh, back we're going to see in a second. We just want to um, wait. All right, Hash, we want to wait for a winner. Hashtown won the playlist. Yeah, Hashtown's on top, man. I will say there were a few upsets along the way, but he was very consistent today. Yeah, oh, yeah, totally. Yeah, guys, definitely give him a run for his money on that last race, though. Did you come from fifth or sixth place to get second, Beck? Um, I, I started all the way at the back, and uh, along with the Marcus. <laughs> right, right, right. So yeah, we did a good job, I think. Awesome. Beck, tell us any upcoming stuff you guys as a crew have co going on. Uh, well, um, we always, uh, yeah, we have our Team B Team stuff always, and um, well, we're trying to get some Crew B crews on uh, ongoing yeah, in the, a couple of months. You guys mentioned that 5,000 like, race yeah. earlier, right? <laughs> Of course. What, what did you say? Well, Sorry. that was that was actually uh, Bob. Right. Yeah. Right. But they, you guys are going to do it, right? You guys are going to get involved with that, surely. Yeah, we. Yeah, I think we will. <laughs> uh, you know, the uh, their guys have that uh, GTA 5000 tournament, which they also uh, invited us for. So we'll be uh, we'll be joining the second season of that too. Awesome. Uh, um, so yeah, we we have uh, some things going on. Uh, well, we definitely yeah. appreciate you guys coming out. You played a great race today. Thank you. Absolutely. Was now, the final it, standing? Well, it? I'm tr I'm going to tell you, but it looks like Bob Mendez is trying to join to the Skype, and I want to wait. Just time. It's, tr it's pushing. He's got probably 1% left. Please let him join, because I can't look at that avatar he, anymore. He's got to be exhausted. That duck face is crazy, down the dude. street and coming back. <laughs> okay, well... We tried, Bob. Sorry. Yo. Sorry, guys. Oh, it's okay. Oh, there we go. Yo, it's yo. okay. All right. Oh, you ready? Man. I feel bad. Wow. Man. I guess you, I missed are the you last race there. Baby Jessica? That was a 35 year old reference. <laughs> uh, it nice. was. You did but it I like yourself, it. My friend. Anyway, we, we have the tally. Oh, wow. Bob, your team did not win. It was Hero <laughs> yeah. 137 to 103. But honestly, it was incredible racing. Yeah. Great racing. And and Bob, like you just you showed what your crew's all about. You you couldn't get online. You're that's you're in what a, his crew's you're all in about. A van. Yes, <laughs> no, but he's in a van. They work together. He did the best he could, even though he couldn't play. He still showed up. Class Supporting act them. all the way. Yeah. That's Thank what you. I was trying I to get out <laughs> in eight I, sentences. I feel horrible <laughs> not being there for my team on the race because I felt like they could have used a little help there, but. Uh, Hey man, I like you said, I did what I could. I was in the damn truck on the internet. You saw no, me. No, that, uh, that was serious yeah. dedication right there. And, li and listen, you've got uh, all those events coming up. You've got the race tournament coming up, so you'll yeah. show up then. Um, September 13th, the GTA 5000 round two. We'd love to have you guys join one of our creators events at any time. Just shoot me or play me a message, an email, whatever, Skype. You got it all now, so you can shoot me a damn text if you want, man. Awesome. Uh, 
and we'd love to have you in any event. I, uh, the guys would have a blast. I'd like to lose some more money to you at some point in the future. <laughs> and and, sure. and I mean, Beck, uh, any final words as the champion, repping the champion? Um, well, uh, I think we did a great job again. Uh, you did. We beat Malicious Intent again. What was the final standing? <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. Really, really hear that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll play your game. It's 137 <laughs> to 103. Yeah, all right, 137 to 103. Well, a friendly big, rivalry uh, here. No, but really, it was great stuff. And, and guys, you can follow us at Twitter, at Rockstar Games. All right, and you might be already following. Everyone, appreciate that. Everyone watching at home, if you like what you saw, we've got stuff like this all the time. We've got crew battles. Uh, yesterday, we had Bass Drum and Death. We're on the soundtrack. They came in. We have soundtrack artists playing the game with us. We have event streams, all sorts of good stuff going on. Hit the follow button. Do that. It's right at the bottom of your screen there on Twitch. And you can check us out at the, news, uh, the Newswire, rockstargames.com slash newswire. And thank you so much. We'll see you next time. Can I can I just say to you guys? Thank you very much. I'm going home right now.